Hi, this is Sarah from the Crafty Girls, and today I'm going to show you how to make a ring that I invented on the Monster Tail Loom. This can also be done on the Rainbow Loom. So if you're using the Monster Tail Loom, you're going to make sure that the red dot is pointing away from you. So this will be making it in instead of a U. And then turn it like that. Then you're going to do just a simple outline. It's going to feel um, kind of weird at first, but just go from the center to the left, center to the right, um, and then just do a simple outline. and then push your bands down and it might feel weird because it's so tiny but then you're going to take your second color and you're just going to make an X then take your second color make an X like that then you are going to take the color of your outline and you're going to make a cat band so wrap it around about three times like that and then turn it over and then you can get your hook you're gonna reach through that cat band and you're gonna just flip the ones that go from the center to the left and the center to the right um, don't flip any other ones And then you're just going to flip the X's, um, basically when you just reach through there, grab one of the X colors and it'll kind of lean where it's supposed to go. And then do that for um, each part of the X. And I'm not proud of my address. In the torn up town, no postcode then you're going to reach through here and you're just going to grab the sides and you're going to flip the outline so see you when you're done Okay, and now you're going to reach your hook through all these bands and you're going to do a chain of three. Um, sometimes it's hard to get in there because of the band. And you're just doing a simple chain, just like you would for any bracelet or ring. It's just going to feel weird because um, this loom is fairly small. And if you're wondering if it's worth getting the monster tail loom, um, you can make other stuff on there um, besides rings. You can make bracelets too. And then you're going to take your C or S clip and you're going to attach it. I like to take it with my fingers, stretch it against two different fingers, and then just attach it, pull it off your loom, and then take your other side of your extension and attach it, and then there's your ring.